In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to kind of jerry-rig your own hamstring curl machine. All you need is two things. One is you need one of these resistance band with an ankle strap attachment. And one, uh, one of these Swiss balls. One thing you wanna make sure is get some really long socks or pants because this will dig into your shins and it's it's just not gonna feel really good. All right, so there's a little trick to this. So I'm gonna put it on this one on this side. So I don't know if you need to get closer so people can kind of see this. So go low, but above the joint, ankle joint, wrap it around, and then this one, I know this looks weird, but I'll explain why. All right, so then I'm gonna flip it around, okay? so. I'm gonna want this over here, so I'm gonna flip this way. Okay, pretty cool, right? And then what I'm gonna do is I wanna make sure this is facing the ground. So you might have to twist it a little bit. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you why we want this. So if I'm going on the ground, okay, and you wanna flex your feet, and then I'm just doing my hamstring curls, after a while, it will tend my knees, even though I'm wearing, putting, <laughs> hi kitty, even though I'm on a, a yoga mat, my knees are still pressing into the ground. So after a while, that doesn't feel good. So if you think about the machines at the gym, there is a space. Your knees do not have the pressure. So what I found is if I grab this yoga ball, tuck it right in really close to me and then roll on top of the ball now you may need to go a little bit further back because the tension might be too much so you roll okay and then i interlace my fingers i lean forward now this really mimics the lying hamstring curl machine so well it feels good and then just do 10 to 15 repetitions and start with a, a lighter band and then move up to the medium and maybe even the heavy. The heavy one just uh, is just too tight for me, so I really like this medium band. I think these are still available. They have a whole bunch of them. So I'll include the link in the description below. And uh, I have two videos that I thought you might enjoy. One, <laughs> a little out of breath. <laughs> um, one is using that uh, Swiss ball and another is a foam roller. So that's a good hamstring workout. And I also have a killer quad workout. I think it's something like a little over four minutes. So if you can do that uh, quad workout it's called the Darden 3030 split squat, you're a rock star. So I'll link that as well. If you like this video, let me know. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon.